What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another Big J Basketball video. We've got a new product here, 1920 Donruss. Uh, I'm starting to see a lot of these pop up in Targets and Walmarts now, so it looks like pretty soon this will be pretty readily available. We have a uh, product uh, review here, uh, comparison. So we have two fat packs, one blaster, and one hanger box. So we'll try each of these formats and see which one we like best. I actually ripped a 41 pack gravity feed and it was such a long boring video with no hits uh, So I'm not gonna subject you guys to that. It was not fun to, to do or to watch. So I'm not gonna post that one I did uh, already open one blaster off camera uh, And in that blaster we got some decent stuff. I didn't hit any Zions in that 41 pack uh, gravity feed, but at least I actually got two um, out of one of those blasters. So there's a Zion base rookie and then also out of the blaster um, was a Rui Hachimura rookie orange laser, which is a really cool looking card. If you can kind of see that laser effect on the video there, it looks really, really nice. Um, so yeah, we pulled better stuff uh, off camera out of the blaster than we pulled out of uh, anything out of that 41 pack gravity feed. So having said that, let's get right to the the break now, we'll start with our fat packs. So, actually before I open it, these fat packs, you can get um, hollow green and yellow laser and hollow red and blue laser parallels. Green and yellow are not numbered. The red and blue might be numbered. Kind of, can't really see on the back there. Here we go. Yeah, numbered to 15. The red and blue are numbered to 15. So it would be really nice to pull one of those red and blues uh, number to 15, but I'm not going to hold my breath. I'm sure they're pretty hard to hit. So here's what the base card looks like. There's the front and there's the back. Really nice clean design on Donruss this year. I like it a lot. I think I actually prefer it to last year's Donruss. Um, it does, it's not a really cheap feeling card. It doesn't feel quite as cheap as Hoops feels. It feels a little bit uh, nicer of a card stock. So let's get through our, there's gonna be a lot of base in here. We'll have a nice big base stack. By the end of this video, we'll start stacking all of our base here. What we really want are the, the rookies and the lasers. Fultz, here's a LeBron Fantasy Stars insert. Not a bad looking card. Another insert. Put kind of good inserts over here. We'll put the base inserts over there. So here's one of the green and yellow. So there's Joel Embiid. Get a nice laser pattern. This is a non-numbered card. Put that with our parallels. And we'll put this with the hits. That's not a bad card. Embiid's a good player. And then here's got a bunch of rookies probably in here. So Ign Ignis Br Ignis Brzdakis. <laughs> DeAndre Hunter, Gafford. There's another Zion. It seems like Daniel Gafford is running right next to Zion. I didn't pull any Daniel Gafford or any Zion out of those 41 packs in the gravity feed. And when I hit the two Zions in the blaster, he was next to Daniel Gafford every single time. So put base rookies, Zion, I'll, that's a hit. I'll consider that a hit. Nasir Little, probably it for the rookies in this pack. And then probably just a bunch of base here. Yep. Okay, so that's one fat pack down. I'll have to try and I don't want to have too many stacks of cards here, but I want to try and remember what I pulled out of out of what format, so we can kind of do a recap at the end. I think we got another one of these green and yellows. Be nice if it was a rookie. Let's kind of blow through our base here. Good expectations insert. Nikhil Alexander Walker. Donovan. And we'll put this with the other inserts. Oh, it's a rookie, and it's Kyle Guy. Nice rookie parallel there. It's another Rui, Isaiah Roby, RJ Barrett, Carson Edwards. So some decent rookies in there. J. 
Jalen McDaniels, and then this is going to be more base. Yeah. Okay. So we've already got just two fat packs. We got a big stack of base here, and we still have a hanger box and a blaster still to go. So there's a lot of cards here, a lot of packs to open. So don't want to make this too long of a video. That gravity feed video that I didn't post was 25 minutes and very boring. So here's what you can pull out of the hanger. So green flood. So those don't have the laser, um, like that Rui orange or, or the Kyle guy we pulled there. The green flood is just like a kind of a flat green card. Uh, but there's a uh, Raider Rookie Signatures Green Flood in here as well. So to pull an autograph would be really sweet. I'm not sure if we'll be able to do that. Again, I'm sure out of retail, you know, cheap retail products like this, autographs are very, very hard to pull. But we got 50 cards. Big stack. There's going to be a lot of base cards in here. So again, we'll probably get through the base stuff pretty quickly. Drummond, Jared Allen, Clint Capella, Wendell Carter, Danilo Gallinari, Deadman, Curry, Karis Levert, Bogdanovich, Otto Porter, Horford. All right, so now we're getting to our, so here's the green flood cards. So it should be about three or four of these in here, I think. So it's got a hollow, like a green hollow, but it doesn't have the laser effect like the other ones. Rollins Noel, Kevin Herter. I think this is a green flood insert. Yep, Anthony Davis changing stripes. It's not a bad looking card. Giannis, fantasy stars. John Wall and another Anthony Davis. So yeah, so you can tell that one definitely was uh, the green version. So this is the green flood parallel with the hollow and that's the standard standard version there. All right, let's get to our rookies now. So we should have another big stack of rookies. Romeo Lankford, Jalen Noel. There's another Rui. Isaiah Roby, RJ Barrett. These guys have run together too, apparently. I think these three were in the same order in the last, uh, last fat pack. Carson Edwards. Jalen McDaniels, Ty Jerome, Tremont Waters. Goga Batat, Schofield, Tyler Hero. I have not pulled a John Morant base rookie yet. So out of the full gravity feed, a blaster, all this stuff already, uh, what we've opened so far, zero John Morant. I don't know why he's so hard to hit for some reason. And again, big stack of base. Not going to go through all these cards individually. Yeah, because we still have uh, an entire blaster to open up. So... I don't know, I think we probably got a little bit better stuff out of the fat packs than we did the hanger, but that's probably just luck. It's not necessarily the fat packs are better. Um, okay, time for product number three now of this comparison video. So just like pretty much most other blasters, you're gonna get one autograph or one memorabilia. So the one blaster I opened was a memorabilia card. It was a Kevin Garnett jersey card. Um, here are the kind of things you can pull out of here. So again, low numbered stuff, purple lasers numbered to 15, um, rated rookie signatures, hollow orange laser. So again, we could get autographs out of here, but not gonna hold my breath on an autograph on this one. So we got 11 packs, eight cards per pack for 88 total cards. So there's probably a memorabilia. Uh, I think that's it right there. So we'll hold that one till the end and we'll start ripping these packs now. So probably, I think two rookies per packs out of here. So got a lot of base and one in there. There's a Luca, complete players. Put that with the good stuff. Jalen McDaniels and Ty Jerome. And then two more base. So big stack of rookies also. Base, base, base. 
Look at some managed grid expectations. Another Tremont Water is another Goga. So I probably have two to three or more of pretty much every rookie, except John Moran, which I've hit zero. So it might just be the collation in my area. For some reason, none of the John Moran base cards made it over my way. Devin Booker, Admiral Schofield, and Tyler Hero. Big stack of base cards. That's the big difference between opening all the prism and those products versus something like Donruss, you end up with a giant stack of base. I'm gonna have to go through and sort all this stuff later to see how close I am to a complete set. James Harden League leaders. Got a Bull Bull and a Jackson Hayes. I would really like to hit that John Morant at some point. Really surprising out of 41 gravity feed packs, couple fat packs, couple blasters, hanger box, zero John Morant. Maybe he's coming soon. KZ Okpala. There it is. <laughs> Finally. Oh, it's just a base rookie. It's probably only with a couple bucks, but man, when, there, when you've hit every rookie three or four times and there's that one guy that you just just can't seem to hit and it happens to be one of the top guys it feels good to finally finally pull one but so far nothing else really earth shattering we got an orange laser in here maybe it's another rookie like the Rui that I hit off camera oh is a rookie who is it ah my boy Ignis ah he's been following me everywhere ah, at least it's a rookie I'll take it. Cabin Gelly, Weatherspoon. A couple more base. Okay, now that I've hit that John Moran, I'm pretty sure between all the other packs I've opened, uh, Gravity and then the stuff off camera, and then these, I would be surprised if I haven't uh, completed the, the base set yet. Base, base, base. There's a... Great expectations, insert Kobe White, Grant Williams and Pascal, and then a couple more base. So nearing the end here, four more packs, and that last pack's gonna have the jersey card in it. Which probably means no autograph uh, in this box, but that's okay, I wasn't really expecting one. KD, Batum, Aaron Holiday, Another LeBron, I think I hit one of these earlier. PJ Washington and Nick Claxton. Lowry and Fournier. Delhi, Kuz, Tory Craig. Knox, base insert, Kobe White rookie and a Keldon Johnson, Chandler Parsons, Kelly Oubre Jr. Just two packs, two packs to go. Kyrie, oh, we got another orange in here. I don't think it's a rookie. Robin Lopez, Zubac, Aaron Holiday. Yeah, not a rookie. But here's a couple rookies, Terrence Mann and Dylan Windler. Rookies and base. All right, last pack. Tried to make it under 15 minutes. We're gonna be really close to that by the time this ends. Courtney Lee, just gonna save our, save that Jersey card till the end. Nikhil Alexander-Walker and a Cody Martin for our two rookies. Harry Giles, Julius Randle, Courtney Lee, and Jalen Brown. See if we can recognize the initials here. I always like to test myself. CLV, Karis LeVert. All right. <laughs> winner, winner, chicken dinner. No bonus points for guessing the right guy. 
Okay, but that's our standard jersey card. All right, so let's do a quick recap. Between two fat packs, a hanger, and a blaster, big stack of rookies. So it's definitely not hard to, to pull most of the rookies, although it did prove difficult for me to get that John Morant finally. A couple of the inserts uh, or parallels. Here's the orange laser. A uh, couple of these generic retail inserts. That's what the green flood looks like. Another Grid Expectations insert. And then, not really any huge hits. We didn't get any numbered cards or autographs or anything. Um, but we did pull two of these LeBron cards. This was an orange laser. At least it was a rookie. Not a top name, but I'll take it. Luca, AD. Kind of showing the difference between that green flood and the standard insert. Giannis. Kyle Guy, rookie, Zion base rookie, and then the Embiid, green and yellow. All right, so this Donruss stuff is a fun rip. Again, I, I kind of like the cheap products. Sometimes you can get a whole big stack of cards for not a ton of money, as opposed to all the money we, I've been spending on Prism and other kind of mid, <laughs> mid-range products. So it's always a fun break to try out something, something different and something that doesn't cost a lot to get a lot of cards. Uh, good bang for your buck. So. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, but speaking of Prism, we are going to be back with a lot more Prism soon. I've been holding on to my last couple boxes of Prism. I got a Mega Box, a bunch of Blasters, a couple Fanatics boxes, and four Hangers. I actually just found a Hanger Box sitting alone by itself at a Walmart the other day. So stay tuned for many, many, many more Prism videos uh, still to come. All right, thanks for watching.